In this video, we're going to go over the interface tab in the Elan configurator. Alon can do something truly unique as far as how we customize the end user experience, as far as what they have access to control. And we can change that per interface as well as per user. And what I mean by that, let's take a look at some touch panels. Maybe you've got a system done, there's a touch panel in the master bedroom, there's a touch panel down in the basement. We may want to have full system access at the touch panel in the master bedroom, access to the security system, the lighting, the whole system in general. Or maybe in the basement, we only want to be able to control media AV in the basement or lighting loads in the basement. And we can also do that for mobile devices. If we look at, you know, mom and dad's cell phone, they log into the lawn system. They can control everything from irrigation to door locks to the security system, or maybe little Jimmy on his mobile device, we really only want to have him slim down access to what he can control. And that would be defined per device. We also have the ability to do that with remote users. So if you're accessing the Elan system remotely, you can customize the experience. Maybe you have a cleaning service or a landscape company that has access to the Elan system solely to open a gate or something on the side of the house. Whereas mom and dad logging into the system, they'd want full access to everything that the Elan system has to offer. And all of this is defined and configured in the interface tab. So we're going to navigate here and we'll see that we've got interface devices. These are all the physical interface devices that the Elan system has seen, whether this be an iPhone, a laptop, a touch panel. And if we go through here and we open one up, we can see that per interface, we've got all the different subsystems. We've got security, lighting, media. If I go to, let's take climate, for example, we've got two boxes that pop up. We've got available pages and selected pages. And maybe on this specific iPhone, I don't want to have the master bed T-stat on there. I'd simply drag it from selected and remove it and place it in available. And now what we've done is we've moved that from just this specific interface. Now, this is something we can do with every subsystem. If we go into media, if we go into lighting, I can, everything that's available, I can give it access to available versus selected. This truly enables us to customize the Elan user experience per interface. Now, I also said we could do this for remote users, right? So if we scroll down, these are all our touch panels we talked about or physical devices. Then we get into users. So you see, I've got three users here, one of them from my cloud account, another one I created, and that one we've got for the cleaning service. So we open this up and you can also see the same amount of options here. So above, I was customizing something per physical interface, and now I can customize something per remote users.